Welcome to Two Minute Warning. I'm Danielle Avari, and a happy 4th of July to all of you. Today is the celebration of the signing of the Declaration of Independence, but this past week has mostly been about the signing of new NBA contracts, which is kind of appropriate if you think about it, because there is nothing more American than paying our professional athletes absurd, like I'm talking obscene amounts of money. Let's talk NBA free agency, shall we? Start the clock. Steph Curry signed a five-year, $201 million contract with the Warriors, making it the largest deal in NBA history. According to a tweet from NBA writer Tim Reynolds, that means that Steph Curry will make $170.22 every second of every Warriors regular season game for the next five years. Durant, Iguodala, Livingston, and Wes also all re-signed with the championship winning Warriors, but Steph's contract was just so amazing that it kind of stole their thunder. And speaking of thunder stealing, Paul George is headed to OKC to join the 2017 NBA MVP Russell Westbrook. Meanwhile, Chris Paul was shipped off to the Rockets, and JJ Redick was able to sign a one-year $23 million deal with the 76ers. I know, I know, trust the process, which the more I hear starts to sound like something that someone would say to get me to join a cult. But this Colt's gonna be really good, so sign me up. And Jimmy Butler was traded from the Bulls to the Timberwolves, and then at the introductory press conference gave out his actual personal cell phone number. I've only called like eight times. He's totally gonna call back. And switching gears to another great American pastime, eating. Today, July 4th, Joey Chestnut, a man from San Jose, California, set a new record eating 72 hot dogs to win his 10th Nathan's Hot Dog Eating Contest. And they're paying Curry $200 million? Look at this! It's pretty unbelievable. Kind of like the decision in the Pacquiao Horn boxing match on Saturday. Horn was declared the winner by unanimous decision. Pac Man landed 182 punches, Horn landed 92. You be the judge. As for winners who actually earned their win, cheers to another amazing Danielle. And no, I'm not talking about myself, I'm talking about the much more amazing Danielle Kang, who won the Women's PGA Championship on Sunday, her first major title win. And finally, my fellow Americans, there are just 56 days until college football is finally here. So hang in there. That's my time. Thanks so much for watching. Please tune in next Tuesday for a new episode of Two Minute Warning. Happy 4th of July. And you know, I think Jimmy Butler had it right. I think we should just all give out our personal cell phone numbers. So mine is 